All right, I got a really, really easy method. If you guys, anyone out there playing this game, Star Sand, that just came out the other day, this new desert open world survival game, first of all, you got to figure out where the hell you are. But if you guys are curious on how to get a bunch of supplies like cloth um, and different uh, metal and uh, clay bricks and uh, just all kinds of different things that you need, I have a really simple method for you guys to get unlimited supplies. So, you know, you got to get to the pyramid here. You can use my map if you want. I think the map only shows you the starter house that you wake up in. Um, so you got to put down different markers and kind of build the map yourself. So you can kind of go off what I did here or, uh, you know, you just figure out where the hell the pyramid is. Okay. Once you get to the pyramid, I'm going to show you a very easy method to just stack up on a bunch of supplies if you guys want to do that. Because I know when starting a game like this, it doesn't really hold your hand. And you kind of have to figure out, like, how the hell, what, what the hell do I do with this brick? Or, you know, how do I get the uh, plans to craft this? And I will say, when it comes to the uh, different blueprints, you actually have to go to the ruins. There's different structures that have been ruined. And you just want to go there, and you'll find the uh, the plans to all different things. Maybe I'll do a video covering, like, how to get the katana sword and different things. I don't know. But I do want to show you guys a really easy method on getting, um, like, cloth and a bunch of building materials that you'll need. Because when I first started out, I really had no clue. It's just like, get hemp. Like, how the hell you get hemp? Well, actually, you get hemp by marijuana plants, which are in the game. But, all right, guys, I am at the pyramid here, okay? Um, and very simple, what you're going to want to do is put down a shelter or a bed so you can save your game. So once you get here, just save the game. You're going to run into the pyramid. There's going to be, um, there's gonna be two loot boxes that you can get to. But if you do build the temporary floor inside the pyramid, you can actually get to uh, four loot boxes. And what you're going to do, guys, is you're just going to run in. You're going to loot these loot boxes. Oh, my camel is hungry. And then you're going to run back to the tent. You're going to save your game. And then you're just going to quit to the main menu. And then you're going to load back in. So you literally can do this over and over and over and get tons and tons of supplies. Like if you need the metal things, the clay bricks, the wood planks, the cloths. Uh, you can stock up on them within a short period of time. So just run in, grab the loot, run back to the tent, save your game, load to the main menu, come back in, loot the loot boxes again because they just keep respawning. Super freaking simple. I was able to stack up a bunch of stuff um, doing this here. Like, you know, these... Uh, the little metal items, cloth, like, because at first, like, I had to make, uh, you know, clothing and it said get hemp and I had no clue how to do that. Uh, it's actually from the weed plants. There's a bunch of marijuana plants in this game. And then down here, guys, is where you can uh, use the metal pieces to make a temporary floor, which will allow you to get to another section of the pyramid that has more loot boxes. Now, I may do another video on this thing showing how to get some of the blueprints for, like, the katana sword and different things. I don't know yet, but I just want to do a quick video to show how to get tons of supplies in this game for the for those of you that are playing this uh this new open world um survival game that just came out so all right it's gonna wrap it up guys i hope this will help some people out there that are googling how to find this stuff if you guys can uh, drop a like on the video and subscribe it'd be cool and i'll see you guys later Peace.